Hello, earlier in the day, I found a mussel this big. And me and Bonnie, we're gonna try and go find some more. We're gonna get some nets, we're gonna go down to the river. And we're gonna see if there's more of these in there. You can't see, because it's, like, it's like a black, horrible river, but look at that. We're gonna see if we find a live one, aren't we? <laughs> right, see you in a minute. So we picked up the net and we're just off to get the mussels now. So I think it's called a swan mussel, which is like a large freshwater mussel. But um, I don't know if there's any more, but we're going to have a look. You hear that? Oh, that was a woodpecker. Did you hear that woodpecker? You didn't? Did you hear it then? Yeah. Hopefully you're picking that up. Just forgot my wellies, had to go back. <laughs> right, we're on a roll now. Let's go. So this is the field, and we're gonna go ooh, along there, that edge. Right, let's get over this. Do you need me to help you? Hello, sheep. So out your boot. Is it falling off? So I've never done this before, and I'm guessing it's as simple as you run a net through the rain. Not 100% sure. I think that's what I'm just gonna do. We're just gonna run the net through the rain and just potluck. I don't know if there's an actual way. If there is a way, let me know in the comments below and I'll try that next time. But for now, I'm just going simple old gun ho. Let's get those muscles. And uh, we'll probably put them back. I don't think we're gonna keep them. We just wanna get one alive. Woo! We love a good woo. We're on an adventure. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Just go along this edge and see if we can find any. Basically, my idea is instead of just putting your net in and hoping, I'm going to walk along here. This is like roughly where I found the shell. I'm going to find shells along the side. And if if I was not a, I wouldn't get a shell and take it really far away. I would just get out and just eat it there and there. So my hoping that if we find shells, you know that directly opposite it. Hopefully the mussels will be in there. That's my theory. Yeah, we found a bit of shell. I think. Yeah. We found a shell. Oh, you did find a shell. Let's have a look. See, they're big, aren't they? So <coughs> hopefully that means in this bit of the river. There's another shell. And there's another bit there. It has broken. Yeah. Shell. And you got some more. So I don't know how deep this is. I think that's quite deep, to be honest. Well, it doesn't look too bad over there. I'll have a few drags. And we'll see. Look at that tree it's just sort of fallen over, but hasn't. It? it looks like it's fine, but it has fallen over. Yeah. Boots off in here. It's really, I, I don't know. I feel like it's impossible to do it with a net. I think you just, there's so much rubbish in there. Come on, you're gonna drown if you carry on. Going through the, the soggy field. We're gonna to go to the bridge and we're just gonna do a bit there. I don't know if I'll find one today, but it's been exciting for Bonnie to get out. Oh, careful, that's a deep bit. He coming? Some more. Found another one. But every time, I just like, I like sift through the mud. And I don't find anything. I don't know if they've got to be attached to something. Or like, how deep do you think it is? Oh, I think I found bottom then. Like, run it along, trying to grab stuff. Oh, it stinks. And every time I do that, I think, oh, well, it's going to be dirty. So try and clean I'll keep going it's just not working out um, I've just been thinking if I was a mussel where would I live and there is a little wood up there and I think there's a little stream I think if I was a mussel I'd want to live in the stream so we're going to try it let's have a look this is our little nature reserve so inside this little pond I'll show you um, and it's currently looked after by some other people. 
but there's feed buckets. It encourages wildlife. It's not a very big area, it's like the size of a football pitch or something. It's nice inside, we'll have a look. But the river grows across into the little lake. I think we might have a look there. If not, I run out of ideas and you need like proper machinery to get them out, I suppose. Because I just don't know where they are. And here we are. So there's like a path that runs around the outside. It's like a mini reservoir. A little path runs around the outside, a little island, and you get a ring of water around it. Let's be careful, Bon, okay? It's all flooded, like over there, it just seems to be a river into the field. We'll keep going and have a look. Okay, so the way is flooded from there. Stop, don't go near the edge, darling. But that's where I wanted to go, in there. I thought that would have been a great place for it. It's a little river in and you can get to it properly. But with, with Bonnie, I don't want to risk it. But it's nice. And the little bridge goes there and you've got like an island. Yeah, lovely around here. This is part of the... the We're not now. Why? Because it's all flooded. We're going to go back now, go home. We failed. Again. Quite chilled out, aren't they? So one of them must be the kid. I reckon that one's slightly smaller than the rest. He must be the child. We come back after that failed adventure. I had to wake Lila up. Um, I'm going to think, I think if I do a bucket, with like a grates on the back and you just drag it up, you will get one. So I think that'd be my next, the next thing I'll have to make a bucket, cut the bottom into like stripes, like thin stripes like that. And I reckon it will let the mud out and you'll just pick up the bigger items. Try that next time. Anyway, thank you for watching the video. Kadoosh.